Manly may have ended their season on a seven-game winning streak, but is this going to be some summer on the peninsula? There were already rumours that Des Hasler could quit with the new CEO coming in. And now, even more scary, there are reports that the Travojevic brothers could be set to walk. There are rumours that they don't see eye to eye with Daly Cherry Evans and have thrown their weight around in support of Des Hasler and they could move on as soon as 2023. Obviously, no discussions with clubs yet. They'd probably have to all three of them go together and I'm not sure if any club outside of the Tigers really has the cap room for it unless they're all willing to take pay cuts somewhere. But ever since the Pride jersey, and I do stand by that the club were trying to do the right thing and a positive thing, they just went about it the completely wrong way. And there is obviously a shift, drift in the playing group. It's obvious on the field. At Brookie Oval, attending that final game, and looks like there was one even in person. So, this summer, man, 12 months ago, Manly were in a top four spot. Were a premiership contender, there were the outside chance. Tommy Turbo was having the best individual season of all time. And he could not, he may not be at Manly next season. We aren't certain. Where there's smoke, there is fire. My suggestion is that Manly are more than likely to cave around these three. I see them getting rid of all of those players instead of these three. But if they can't make him happy, I mean, Jake, he's going to turn 29 next year. Tommy's getting older. Obviously, he spent a long time on the sideline. And Ben's even getting, he's going to turn 22 next year. And they haven't played much finals football. Tommy's only played the four games last year with his, was his only second finals appearance because he missed that 2019 one. And unfortunately, as much as I love Daly Cherry Evans, ever since he signed that long-term contract, the club hasn't really been successful. It's been finals one year and not finals the next. This could be a disaster. They just signed the biggest sponsorship deal in the competition. They had the most shut on iron games this year and they certainly di didn't live up to expectations. The most disappointing team this year and it may only get worse. This is the most difficult position the Manly Club has ever been in in my lifetime. This is going to be a crazy summer, but Des Hasler may not be in a job, and the Travojevic brothers may be playing elsewhere in 2023.